This is introduction to your ACC FA paper, which is also called F3. Uh, this is the first paper usually when, is, when students start at ACC qualification, they start with F3. My name is Sayyid Muhammad Ali. I am an accounting and finance professional with over 20 years of working experience. And I have been teaching SACA for almost 15 years now. So as for the syllabus, um, syllabus is not really very difficult, although it is long, but it is very interesting. Uh, this is fundamental of financial accounting. So it means that we start with the very basics of accounting. We know what is financial, you know, what is financial accounting about? What do we get? How do we make financial reports? What are the financial reports, income statement and balance sheet? How do we record transactions? Because ACC F3 actually, it is focusing on bookkeeping. There are two parts of accounting, bookkeeping and reporting. Bookkeeping is the process of recording the financial transactions. So in this thing, we will we are going to discuss how to record the financial transactions. So it means that we are going to learn debits and credits. We are going to learn journals and ledgers and then financial statements. And then, you know, what uh, errors or mistakes we made while uh, preparing the financial statements or while recording the financial data, financial transactions, how to correct those errors. Then we will learn about cash flow statement, income statement, balance sheet. Um, of course, we'll do analysis of these financial statements. We'll do ratio analysis and then there is a consolidation thing. So quite a lot of topics are covered here because we follow BPP books. So there are 26 chapters in the syllabus. Um, so which looks like that quite a lot of areas to cover, uh, but not in great depth. Actually, this F3 paper, it becomes basis for your next paper, which is F7 financial reporting. So the knowledge which you learn from F3, you are going to use it in F7 somehow. Uh, out of 26 chapters, which I mentioned, I can say that 10 or 12 chapters are those which are really challenging in which you need to do quite a lot of effort. But then other chapters, you would be uh, easily understand. Uh, you will easily understand those chapters. Now, what is included in our course? Uh, I have covered the each and every part of the syllabus, the entire syllabus with very detailed lectures covering every topic uh, because you will get two books. One is called the study text. One is called the practice kit. So study text is actually where you are learning the concepts. Practice kit is where you are applying the concept. You are doing questions. So I've covered the entire study text. Then I've done quite a lot of videos on doing practice questions. So when you see a question, how do you approach the question? How do you understand the question? How do you extract the data? How do you quickly, uh, how to find out answer quickly? So you will find a lot of practice question videos as well. Uh, then you get short notes, which I'm using the short summaries for each chapter. Uh, then you will also get the, you know, the Excel files because we are doing questions on Excel files. So you can download those Excel files for your reference as well. So overall, I can say that everything what you need, what everything what you need is included in this syllabus, is included in the in this course to pass, to help you pass your SEC F3 exam in the first attempt with a very good score. Uh, you can always contact me uh, to ask any queries if you have. You can post your comments and I usually respond to that comment. Now, over and above uh, the syllabus areas, what Vertex platform is offering you uh, we have actually, we give you day by day study plan so that you exactly know which video you should watch and which, uh, you know, how to say, which book, which pages from the study text you should read, which MCQs from the practice kit you should do. So study plan you get, then you get uh, active tutor support on the WhatsApp group. Uh, myself, I'm available in the WhatsApp group. We, have, we also have some other academic staff which helps you in the WhatsApp group. Then you've got online quizzes, you've got final mock exam. So everything what is needed, we make sure that we take you from the very beginning to the very end until your exam day. We help you and pass the exam. The only thing which we need from you is to dedicate some time. Now, how much time is needed? How much time is needed to finish this syllabus? Actually, uh, the maximum time period which I put a frame of in, you know, the time frame which I put maximum is 3.5 months. This is the maximum. But I know that it could be easily done in 2 2.5 months as well. If you are not a working professional, if you are a full time student and if you can allocate three hours per day, you can finish this paper in, in 2.5 months easily as well. So I consider an effort of 2 2.5 or 3 hours per day. Let's call it 2 to 3 hours per day for next, uh, you know, two to three months, you will be definitely able to score a good score in the final exam for this.
So if I speak about the exam, it is a computer based exam. You call it CBE on demand, which means that you can take exam any time of the year. It is your choice whenever you feel ready. It is going to be a two hours exam, uh, 50 marks, uh, pass marks are 50 percent. And the exam structure is like there are going to be 35 questions for two marks each MCQs. Some of those questions are uh, conceptual, theoretical. Some of those questions require calculation. So 35 questions of two marks each makes it 70 marks. Uh, then there are two long questions for 15 marks each. So two times 15 makes it 30, 100 marks are there. These two long questions actually, they give you one scenario and on that one scenario, then they ask you short questions like 10 short questions under each scenario you have to answer. And uh, that's how your exam is there. So you spend three hours in the exam center and uh, as soon as you press the submit button, immediately your print out your result comes out, you take your certificate and you walk out. Um, three months time period with approximately two to three hours per day there is absolutely no doubt that you cannot score good. Whatever resources are required, we have provided all the resources. We have uploaded all the resources. And other than that, if you need any support, you can always contact me. So good luck with your uh, ACC qualification. Uh, I wish you all the best. Uh, thank you very much for watching.